If the filter's backflush cycle does not stop and water continuously flows out of the backflush manifold, then you probably have a problem in the piston. To fix the problem, perform the following steps. First, depressurize the system by closing the filter's upstream valve and closing the downstream valve. Perform a manual backflush cycle and verify the pressure gauge is at zero. Disassemble the piston cylinder as follows. First, disconnect the command tube from the piston cylinder. eight screws with a 10 millimeter wrench. Remove the washers. Pull out the piston cylinder. Remove the gasket and put it aside. Then disassemble the piston cover and lay it down beside the piston cylinder. Clean all the piston parts using high-pressure water while shaking and inspecting them well in order to remove any foreign parts that might be stuck inside. Inspect the three seals on the piston parts and piston. If you find a damaged seal, replace it by following these steps. On the piston there are nuts on each side. Lock a 19mm wrench on both nuts and open. Then replace the damaged seal. Reassemble all the piston parts and lock the nuts on both sides. Inspect the bearing and make sure its shape is perfect. Proceed to reassemble the piston. Place the gasket inside the piston cylinder. Place the piston cylinder on the piston cover. Replace the washers and tighten the screws. Finally, reassemble piston in the filter.